Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, Messi has signed for Paris Saint-Germain. Oh my word, I am lost for words, man. He actually left Barcelona, man. Don't know what's going to happen to Barca, but they're going to need to hope to hope for a miracle with Sergio Aguero, man. Otherwise, they are far act. Well, forget about Barcelona for now. Let's talk about Lionel Messi. He is at Paris Saint-Germain. I have seen videos on Instagram, TikTok, YouTube of fans saying, Messi, Messi, Messi. Fuck knows how much he costs. If He has to cost more than a Neymar transfer from Barcelona to PSG. Because how is Neymar? 220 million. I remember that day. It was like 2017. He left in the summer. <sighs> The old Barcelona trio is gone. It's finished. Unless Suarez goes back to Barcelona. But I don't know about that. It's just weird. It doesn't feel, you know... It feels weird. They're too OP. They have Mbappe, Neymar, Ramos, Gigi Donnarumma, Jorginho Wijnaldum from Liverpool to PSG. And now Messi, the GOAT. One of the best players, in the, if not the best. Probably, I reckon he is the best, man. I mean, he's been clear of Ronaldo this season. He's been performing absolutely unbeastful. You know, he's just an incredible talent, man. Probably the most talented footballer I've ever seen in my life. Incredible, man. He's at Paris Saint-Germain. Like, what do you mean? This is ridiculous. <sighs> well, looks like Mauricio Pochettino is happy with that. He's got the best player in the world on his team. And yeah, they should win the Champions League with that front three. Actually, you know what? They probably won't. Because they had an OP front three at Barcelona when it was Suarez, Neymar and Messi and st they still couldn't win it. So my opinion is no. They, I don't think it'll be one of them. They'll win it one time. But then after f a season or two, they'll struggle again. Because, yeah, that's just the type of... I don't know. Because the last time Barcelona won it was 2015. In 2016, they couldn't... Who did they get knocked out by? Atletico Madrid. Oh, my word. Yeah, yeah. In 2017, who did they get knocked out by? It was flipping... What's it? Juventus, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was Juventus. 2018. Roma. 2019. Liverpool. 2020. Bayern. And yeah, it just went wrong for them. Then it <sighs> looks like Messi is just tired of Barcelona, man. It's because so many of, the, of them just left after the 8 2 defeat. Like Vidal, Suarez, too many big, a lot, a lot, some of the big players just left, man, because they couldn't be asked. Barcelona still are, they look like they're, they're going to come back strong. Because they beat, they actually beat Juventus 3 0. It might be a pre season friendly, but Ronaldo and that were playing. So we'll have to see about that, you know. And yeah. I reckon, yeah. Paris Saint Germain versus Juventus in the Champions League final. The two goats challenge for the title. In the last match ever, man. Oh, I want them to play. Like, when they're, like, 43, 42. One, one, one they're, like... You know, one of them's going to retire. Because I don't know who's going to retire first, to be honest. It's a two-year guy. It isn't that big. It's pretty small. Because Ronaldo could play on for, like, at least 43, 44. And, yeah...